Hey, my name is Theo, and a couple of months ago, I was scrolling through Facebook, probably looking at some memes about how stressful end of year exams were, when I came across an ad from this site called Wish, advertising all these random products for $2. I'm talking clothing, suit jacket, $2. Kalele strings, $2. Portable ice cream maker, $2. My immediate reaction was, oh my God. jeepers, creepers, that's my kind of budget. But then there was a moment of skepticism when I thought, Maybe this is too good to be true. That only lasted for a second when I remembered I could buy a life-sized handheld remote control guinea pig for only $2. So I jumped onto this website, Wish. This is no sort of promotion, I can assure you. They are sketchy AF. And added a bunch of these random items to my cart just to see how legit it was. Turns out you do have to spend a bit on postage, so I end up spending all the money I had saved for my Christmas presents, but thought it was with $2. How could I say no? Unfortunately, because they were so cheap, they did take forever to arrive. So over the last few months, my packages have slowly but surely arrived one by one. And even now, only about a third of my things are here, but I couldn't wait any longer. So I'm gonna crack them open, give them a try, and see if they were worth my $2. I actually ordered a stack of items with the intention of doing three different videos, trying dog products, trying $2 sex toys, and just trying random stuff I bought online. However, another issue with this site, the packaging. What is this? The only thing it says on the outside is, Rope. That could be a dog product or a sex toy. So there's gotta be a weird mix of things. First item that arrived from Wish. Description of content. All in Chinese. Oh yes, and because I made this order two months ago, I have no memory of what I ordered. Okay, okay, I see plastic. I'm trying to wrap my brain for any sort of, did I buy a pool toy? Oh, a strong scent. What is it? Yes! This must be the fun blow up brain deer hat hula hoop game I ordered. Are these antlers or a pretzel? One size fits all, they say. I guess balancing could be half the fun. And then I think you're supposed to play with a friend, but I don't have one of those. So, I'm just gonna give it a crack myself. Whoa, oh damn. Whoa, ah, whoa. Oh yeah, oh this is a really cool game. What? Whoa, this could be fun. Hutch defense tools. Cryptic, I like it. One. Ah, uh, so this must be the finger dog toothbrush I ordered. <laughs> Although, I feel like it could just as easily be one of the sex products. A textured condom. <laughs> That's actually really cool. So you stick it on your finger, and it's got the ribs here for the tongue. Ah, ah, ah. The thought of a dry toothbrush bristles ah, on my teeth. Is my worst trigger. Ah. I feel like dogs are pretty capable of cleaning their own teeth, but we'll give it a crack. Shotty, shotty, good girl. Good girl, sit. Brushing your teeth is very important, shotty. You just ate. We can't let you go play with those other dogs and with your teeth looking like that. The lens is over there, not here. The lens is there, shotty. Ooh, yes. All right, now open up just for one second for the video. So I have some treats for you. Yamo. Little does she know they're just in the world. Oh, you like that? What if I do this? Oh, yes. I guess a petting brush will have to do. Now I'm gonna leave you alone before I get in trouble for animal cruelty. <coughs> for a fun little gift, two dollars. Okay. However, completely pointless in a waste of any amount of money. Maybe better to be marketed as that tech toy. This one I'm very excited about because the description says toy. Orange. How intriguing. <gasps> oh, yes. This is legit. Air swimming fish swim through the air. Moves like a real fish. Remote control flying clownfish. Easy indoor fun. That is my kind of entertainment. <gasps> the two dollars would have been worth the bubble wrap alone. I'm lost. Where's the blow up his spout? There's a little hole here, maybe I could utilize that. This is hard. I wanted to spend my $2 on hours of remote control indoor fun in even the smallest of rooms. Not hours of manual labor. No, I do not speak Spanish. Okay, assembly. Could have looked at the instructions to start off with. Congratulations on your purchase of Air Travelers. Insanely fun, fully maneuverable remote control flying fish. Number one, 
Fill the balloon with helium at any party store, flower shop, or grocery store that sells balloons. You may also buy a small party helium tank. Simply fill your air swimming fish with helium inexpensively at any party store. I haven't seen a party store since 1986. I just want to fly around my blow up remote control fish. Top 5 uses for a 2D plastic fish a blanket, a hat, doubles as an umbrella, a skirt. Dog catcher. Hi, Shadi. What are you up to? <laughs> Sit. Sit. <laughs> Actually, doesn't work too well as dog catcher. Or even a kite. Whoa! 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 Yeah! <laughs> this one's just a bonus one, but even like a beach, like sunbathing towel. It's really quite versatile. <laughs> Look, as necessary as a dog catcher is, unless you have a helium tank sitting around at home, do not buy the blob fish. I'm gonna open one of my smaller packages. And I don't know why it has a value, but supposedly this one's worth 38 US cents. And you're charging me two dollars for this? I ordered this. Oh, this is a four port USB charger. Wait, is it useful? Oh, this looks quite nice. So this is a USB plug, and we've got four USB plugs here. First glance, pretty high tech, but does it work? Okay guys, I searched around, and I got my hands on a charging port spot thing. These plugs can go. And now we're gonna try out my USB four port charger. If this works, it could be revolutionary. Okay. Oh my gosh, what? I was literally just about to plug the USB port into the charging thing. They're different holes. That's just, what? This is what we need. That goes in there. Oh. Oh. It fits all right, it fits. <gasps> I don't know why I'm showing you the phone, you can't see anything, but it's charging. <laughs> But what about with two? There we go. I don't have a second device, so I can't actually test the second cord, but let's just assume it works. Well, it works. For now, at least. Just give it 24 hours. Maybe it's just because I don't have that many USB chargers, but I can't tell if this is useful or not. But it was only $2, so who cares? Pillow. Ooh, worth $3.72. So far, I'm sure how this could shape out to be a pillow. Did I accidentally order two of those for our brand new thing? Ooh. Oh, these parts blowing up! Oh, there's another one. Da. A bit different from your standard neck travel pillow. What is this? I don't know. Is this a storage compartment? Unless I can squeeze things down this little tube, I don't think so. The comfort test. Sure about this design. Is this just like an extra layer of pillow? Why is this here? Or is that supposed to be like a backrest? Because my head is not staying on that. Maybe like, wait. I think stage makes sense. Okay, yeah, no, it's not. This has no sense whatsoever. I'm very confused. Now I've saved perhaps the most intriguing item of all for last. I don't think it says the outside is rope. Oh, you don't five US dollars. Get that three dollar saving. This could be a very aggressive sex toy. I have no recollection of ordering two pieces of stretchy grey rope. I don't know why I didn't think to do this earlier, but we're heading on to my order history. Is this it? I could do that. My legs are not that flexible. <laughs> My body's tired already and I haven't even started the sexual part. Oh, it looks like it may be this exercise rope here. But where's the wheel? How am I supposed to exercise with this? One pair wheel pull rope, abdominal pull rope, latex fitness, exercise stretch pull ropes, abdominal wheel accessories. Recent review, Amy said, OMG, talk about a workout, lol. Had my husband's arms burning within seconds. He loves it. Oh yes, I am just feeling the burn. It's $6 now? I got real lucky. Reduced from $72. This 
costs 72 dollars. What if I put this on my foot and attach this one to the end of the weight? This could work. I don't really understand what's supposed to be going on here. Uh -uh. We might be better off sticking to the sex toys. I'm sure you'll come in handy one day. So, that was my general wish all. In review, wishes aside, it's trash. Don't buy from it. Yes, they sent me a couple pieces of random rope which have no real use whatsoever. I am quite excited to find a friend to play that radio hack game with. We'll be seeing each other later. Thank you so much for watching me waste more of my money. Click subscribe, 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 subscribe. subscribe. For a new video every single Sunday. There is a lot of stuff on Wish, so I'm not entirely ready to disregard it. So if you want to see more Wish hauls, let me know in the comments. Give this video a thumbs up. Oh, and leave a comment letting me know which of these items, if you could have one of the items featured in this video, which one would you have? Unfortunately, I'm not going to do a giveaway because postage will be worth far more than the item itself. You can keep up to date with me on my social media during the week. But other than that, I'll see you next Sunday with a new video. Love you lots. Have the best week ever. See you soon. Bye, guys. Hey, yo, my name is Theo. And welcome to the video. McDonald's is my home and my baby's name is Mindy. My cat Broly is dead and I wish I lived in Sydney. My bloating schedule is firm. One time I swallowed a worm. I dream of being a star and collect my hair in a jar.